But in an essay, what is uh, preferable is that you take a stand first in your mind and then write in that direction. So it can be a 70-30, 60-40, but it, I think you should avoid 50-50 thing. Hmm. If you meet a uh, different aspirant and those even who have cleared, they have different strategy. Some are like, it can be prepared, just go prepared. Some are like, I prepare and that's when I, uh, th when I, when I prepare and in final exam, I got lesser marks. Okay. So what was your strategy? Is it like fine to prepare or like too much of change can actually bring a setback to you? Uh, I would like to say whenever you're going for a battle, you have to be absolutely prepared. You have to have all the armors. You, to, you have to have your swords ready in your hand. Mm -hmm. You cannot go unarmed. Mm -hmm. So uh, essay is a very, again, I would like to say that UPSC has restricted our choice mm -hmm. because there are two sections in essay and one, you have to anyways uh, attempt one philosophical mm -hmm. and one substantial essay. Mm -hmm. So you have no choice. Mm -hmm. I being a science student, uh, tackling philosophical essays was a challenge for me. Mm. So now uh, just focusing on your weakness or your challenges won't help. Mm. Cribbing and crying about all that won't help. What I did was, I would like to tell you uh, one my particular strategy for all those whose philosophical essays are relatively weaker than the mm. substantial ones. Mm. So I recognized my strength and my weakness very early during my uh, preparation. So I knew that this is my challenge. Mm. What I used to think in my mind is, that Kriti, even if you get a 45 in philosophical and then you manage to get a 90 in uh, substantial, like, great for you. Mm -hmm. Now, I don't know how the examiner is going to check, but what this helped me was calm my mind down. Mm -hmm. It did not, I did not overstress then on the philosophical part, rather I was focusing on my strengths. Mm -hmm. Plus also brushing up or even or bettering my uh, philosophical sort of essays. But being a, I mean, a science student, I cannot be very perfect like a humanity. I cannot be better than a humanities person who would write a uh, philosophical essay. Mm -hmm. Now coming to the uh, technical aspect of essays, mm -hmm. first thing that an aspirant should remember is that there is a C difference between a GS answer and your essay. Mm -hmm. The very first difference and a very stark one is that introductions for your GS would be very short, one, two, three sentences. Mm -hmm. But for an essay, which is a shock for everyone, I mean it is a first essay will be disastrous. Mm. So what you end up doing is in five, six, seven, eight lines, you, your uh, thinking capacity exhausts mm. because we're not in the habit of writing so much. Mm. We, we uh, During the preparation also, we become so logical. We'll be talking in points and even solving family issues, I talk in points, which after saying <laughs> stuff, I'm like, why was I talking in points? And those people didn't even say anything. Mm. So uh, so coming to from that to essay part where you can't even, you should not even uh, make a bullet point or a flow chart that is a challenge mm. but then again UPSC demands that diversity from a person mm. yes um, coming back yes you must be prepared and you should have your own strategy for the preparation of the essay mm. there is no hard and fast rule how you should write an essay or anything mm. but yes some bullet points are there that your introductions should be really beautiful mm. they have to be long mm. they should not be copied right. suppose one year uh, topper says that I wrote an introduction of uh, stories so mm. you'll follow that mm. Maybe I don't like writing stories or maybe I can't make up a story at that point of time. So then I should not, uh, I should not copy what the other person is doing. Yes, you can think of, you can see other people's what they're doing, what they're saying, but then come up with your own strategy only. So what I did was in philosophical essays, I preferred starting with the quotation. Mm. In substantial essays, I again uh, tried starting with the quotation if I didn't get it. So there were many other things, the scenario of the country, the scenario of the world, um, what right now is going on or some data points. Mm. So uh, I made it a point that uh, if there is, I know how I have to start a philosophical essay and how I have to start a, a substantial essay and similarly for conclusion. Mm. So for an essay, what maximum you can do is that some uh, things you will, they will be anticipated only like uh, women's issues, mostly you will get a question on that. Mm. So if you're absolutely confident of that topic, you simply attempt it. Right. Some topics can be prepared mm. uh, sitting home, like environment mm. or women, mm. uh, the economy of the country, which is very important post COVID now. Mm. So some topics, uh, digital education. So all these topics I also had prepared beforehand. Mm. Not that I wrote an essay, which I learned and then I went and wrote that down, not like that. But yes, I practiced three, four essays in that direction and uh, that was enough. Mm. Uh, so before my essay exam, I personally wrote seven to eight essays, got them evaluated, got uh, many criticisms mm. and uh, then
then imbibed all those and improved. So uh, my uh, fortunately my uh, final exam ended up to be ended up to be great and my marks were also pretty good in essay. So um, uh, an essay and GS first thing that you do is segregate the difference between what uh, essay demands from you and what a GS answer demands from you. You cannot be only balanced in an essay. So for example your essay has a question, mm -hmm. is the economy better now? Mm -hmm. So you can't write a 50-50 no and yes. Mm -hmm. No, you have to take a stand first. Mm -hmm. Like you, yes, you'll have to, you are a balanced person overall, so you will uh, present both the points. Mm -hmm. But what we do in GS is we do a 50-50 thing. Right. Yes, it is good, yes, it is bad, no, it is not good. Mm -hmm. But in an essay, what is uh, preferable is that you take a stand first in your mind mm -hmm. and then write in that direction. So it can be a 70-30, 60-40, but it, I think you should avoid 50-50 thing. Mm -hmm. Because then again, it, uh, it, it says it, it's again stupidly smart. Because either you agree with something or you don't agree with something. It's not a very good idea to be absolutely neutral uh, for a question like, is economy better? Or are women oppressed in India? So you cannot say yes and no both. You have to be 70-30 that yes, the condition is improving, but still it is bad like that. So this uh, difference one must understand mm -hmm. and all this will come when you sit and analyze yourself. This is what some points that I have given, maybe a person can analyze even better and get come up with uh, really even better points. Right. So that's why I think test series plays a very important part because it gives you opportunity to experiment with yourself. So you can come up with new strategy, you can realize this suits you better and the mistake you think other person is not realizing, it helps you realize that as well because third person can point it out. So that's very important and like one question I would ask is did you get philosophical, did you attempt any philosophical uh, essay in your family? Yes, it was a compulsion to attempt. Uh, so yes, I did attempt uh, but it was a very, I mean it wasn't a, any extreme, it was a neutral attempt. Mm -hmm. It was not that great, it was not that bad. Mm -hmm. So uh, it was a balanced thing I uh, and anyways I, I always pick up topics that I am prepared with. So it was a philosophical essay but it was something related to compassion okay. which is uh, what I have practiced also and I am uh, very sensitive towards the environment and animals so it helped my uh, nature helped me but yeah, overall my philosophical essay is not that great so even my final essay was not that great it was uh, just okay mm -hmm. to fetch me enough marks that it can complement my substantial essay mm -hmm. marks mm -hmm.